You may have noticed that I've posted my more recent data packs on Modrinth, not Planet Minecraft where my older ones are. Let me explain, and hopefully convince you, why I've done this, and why you should do the same. Modrinth is a platform for uploading and downloading Minecraft mods, which has been growing in popularity recently. Several months ago, they added support for data packs as well. Since then, I've almost exclusively uploaded to Modrinth, and many other data pack and mod creators have switched from Planet Minecraft and Curse Forge, respectively. There are four main reasons why I think Modrinth is better than the two previously mentioned websites. Number one, the UI. Modrinth has a very nice user interface, well designed, streamlined. I've always found the CurseForge and Planet Minecraft interfaces clunky and hard to use. Have you ever tried to use the Planet Minecraft search feature? It's open source. If you're not familiar with the term, open source projects have their code publicly available on the internet on sites like GitHub. Anybody can go to this website and read all the code that makes Modrinth function. If you know what you're doing, you can even create a copy of the project, make changes, and ask Modrinth to merge them into the official site. So open source projects are good for two things. They're transparent, Anyone can see inside them, there's no secret inner workings. Also, anyone can contribute, meaning the developers don't have to implement every community suggestion themselves. Number three, it has a free public API. I'll explain what that is in a minute, but I'll first note that CurseForge does also have an API, so third party launchers can use mod packs. Planet Minecraft, however, has no API as far as I can find out. What is an API? An API, or application program interface, is a way for people to write code that communicates communicates with a website or app. For example, the Discord API allows people to write Discord bots, pieces of code that use Discord like a human would. You can use a similar concept to automatically upload and download content from Modrinth. Number four, revenue. Now, as a data pack creator with only about 2,000 downloads, I don't earn almost anything. However, the creators of the most popular mods have almost 5 million downloads, which comparing that to my stats is around $4,000. CurseForge does offer monetization, but I think it's for only some creators, I'm not sure how it works really, but Planet Minecraft doesn't offer any revenue to its creators. Now I don't think money will make a difference for most people, but it's nice to have it there. There are other reasons I can name, such as Markdown support, GitHub integration, and more, but those are the main ones. Please note, this is more of a comp comparison between Modrinth and Planet Minecraft than CurseForge, as I've not actually uploaded mods to the latter. However, there's a good video by Purplers about people switching to Modrinth from CurseForge, which was the inspiration for this video. I hope I've convinced some of you, and I'll see you next time.